few high school golf teams can say they've won multiple events this season, but Botno is one of those few. The Braves also have multiple golfers who are often near the top of the individual leaderboards. A winner of five events so far this season, Max Palmer has been one of the top golfers in all of Class B. The Botno Jr. has come a long way since joining the varsity team as a seventh grader. Definitely my mental aspect of it. Like when I hit a bad shot, I just let it go, and that's helped me so much, and I feel like that's why I've got a couple wins here to start the season. You know, he doesn't have to hit every shot. He's got he's to have his misses, too, in certain spots. And so just the mental aspect of the game and, and his ability to recover from a poor shot or a poor hole has been the thing that stood out to me most, especially from last year to this year. This new level of zen translates to his remarkable chipping and putting abilities. I definitely have gotten a lot better with my short game because I've spent way more time on that. And just mentally, I've gotten so much stronger and better, and that's helped me succeed way more. His short game is just, he always complains about it, but he's, it's unreal. He's like, he can spray the ball off the tee and second shot, but his chipping and putting, he always makes up for it. And like, I've seen him shoot amazing rounds, and he just looks like he's not even playing good. Palmer's teammate Alex Lorenz has carded improved scores this year in his third season of varsity competition. I've just been more consistent, like, off the tee. I, I'd like to say I can hit it far, but I kind of dialed it more straight now, and I can tell you where it's going. I used to kind of just spray it everywhere. My short game's always been kind of a downfall, but it's gotten a lot better this year. Alex is another kid that just spends a ton of time on the golf course. Um, he's, he's got length off the tee, and he's got touch around the green. And, you know, with, with Alex, he, he's had some phenomenal rounds this year. If it wasn't for his teammate Max, he would, he would probably have some tournament wins under his belt already. So, you know, Alex has had, has had a great year for us, um, and, I, and he's definitely one of the top golfers in the region and we expect uh, we expect to see him do well uh, at the end of the season too. Lorenz is signed to play college hockey for Dakota College at Botano, a sport he plays left-handed, but he swings a golf club right-handed. I always thought maybe I could be a lefty, but I've just I've always swung it righty and just feels more natural. I mean, I can kind of play both sides in hockey. I'm a lot better lefty, but I can play it righty and golf I just I can't swing a lefty club. The drive to improve shown by guys like Palmer and Lorenz is part of what's made the Braves a successful Class B golf program. you got to have kids that love the game. you, you, you got to have kids that, that really, you know, when they get home from a golf meet, I've got six kids in the Suburban, and, and we'll unload, and oftentimes all six of them are heading right back up to the golf course to golf some more. So they just have, they ha you have to have kids that absolutely love the game, and they spend basically their entire summers on the golf course. And that's what we're fortunate to have right now is we've got kids 7 through 12, that any given day of the week you come up here, there's kids golfing. It's just good to, good to have because it's good, great to see your team succeed and coming up here you just want to be the best you can and practice as much as you can because you want the team to do as good as possible. It's just work ethic and like everyone's up here we all and just like we all are together and we all golf all the time. And they just work on, they know what they need to work on and they work on it whenever they can. And, the team hopes strong postseason results are ahead, with Lorenz hoping to overtake his teammate. A goal for myself, I'd really like to beat Max at least once, and uh, hopefully in regionals I can take, I'm hoping top five, but I'm all right with top ten. Uh, and as a team, I, I think we can win the region, and we should be able to compete up at the top spot for state, but top three in state's good enough for me. You know, we want to contend for and try and win the region championship. I guess that's first and foremost. Um, and get a couple kids in the top 10 of the region. That's, that's always a goal for us. And, and I've got any six of my kids that I'll bring down to the region tournament will be able to finish in the top 10, I think. Um, and if we're fortunate enough as a team to make it to the Sometimes state golf meet, you know, our, we want to bring home hardware, I guess. You know, finish as one of the top three teams. Now, Palmer hasn't decided where he's going to go to college, but he hopes to golf at the next level somewhere outside of his home state.